The former FNM leader's commendations coming just hours after the member of parliament for Marco City, Michael Pintard, was sworn in as the new leader of the Free National Movement. Pintard takes over after being elected during the party's one-day convention on Saturday. He pulled in the majority of votes cast, beating out Central Grand Bahama MP Iram Lewis and East Grand Bahama MP Crazy Thompson. Now, during this morning's brief ceremony at police headquarters, Pintard thanked all those who played a pivotal role in his political journey and also rededicated himself to working tirelessly on behalf of every Bahamian. It is my intention to follow in the footsteps because certainly the shoes are extremely large to fill, but to follow in the footsteps of our founding fathers and mothers, in particular, successful Wallace Whitfield, Arthur Folks, Warren J. Labarty, Maurice Moore, Curtis Macmillan, James Jimmy Shepherd, Dr. Elwood Donaldson, and George Thompson. In the Free National Movement, we know their story. The newly minted FNM leader says his party has left a lasting legacy in the country, particularly as it relates to gender equality. It is to this I promise to commit my efforts to continue a proud tradition in this country where we can boast so many firsts in terms of what women have contributed to national development. That is an important tradition we must follow because it cannot be right that more than 50% of our population is hardly reflected in the national governance of our country. There was an intentional program to accomplish this. And that's why we were able to boast Dame Ivy Dumont and Italia Johnson. So many firsts. Chat if you missed anything, we've got you covered. Subscribe to our ZNS Network YouTube channel and follow us on our social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter for breaking news, live event coverage, web exclusives, and much more.